Rick and I came up with the idea together. We built the story together. Rick, Rick writes. We work even in directing and post. We work very collaboratively. So it's a team effort from like six years ago when we had a weird idea and it grew into this. Uh, I've been through this process a couple of times and usually the creators hate each other at the end and we really still love each other. So it's actually been okay. And what was your favorite part of making this film? Uh, <laughs> I, for me, it was showing up on set every day and seeing that cast and, and getting to work with that cast. I mean, that's... Yeah, I mean, I think the set energy is probably the best part of making any movie and showing up early and everybody working their tails off to make it happen. And um, I think being on set, shooting, is probably the best part. I, th I think that it was just a great chemistry, which sounds sort of cliche, but, but so many people at the end of the shoot, cast and crew, said this is the most fun I ever had working on a film before. And I, I took yeah. that as a big compliment. Yeah. I, I had nothing but like an absolutely great time at, at this festival. I mean, I, 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 the, the, there's such a warmth in the audience. And so often you go to a, a movie and you know, people are eating popcorn and they're like answering their phones. And, but this was, you know, everyone was so focused in and enjoying it and the the response afterwards was so sweet and overwhelming and I'm, I'm you know we shot it like a year and two months ago and I'm happy people are getting to see it I mean Jason the director and Rick and they, they worked so hard on it and I knew when I read this script that there was something it was one of the most special things that I had ever read um, going through all of my acting school and acting training and, and and working in a lot of commercial voiceovers, um, I just I knew that this was a script that I, I had to work on, and so uh, Rick and Jason also knew that I worked as a producer, and so then I got on board and helped make it happen. Being here for a screening of the movie was kind of fun because I'm only used to seeing it with two or three people. The first time I, to see it with a lot of live bodies responding to the film, just. It's a, it's, gra it's a gratifying feeling. It's uh, I mean, it's a it's like a you know it's probably a three million dollar movie that we made for two hundred thousand dollars. I was so, just going to ask the budget. The yeah. budget was two hundred. The budget is two hundred. So. Well, I'm not right for that. <laughs> yeah. It's where every day. I mean, because you're doing a movie in eighteen days, and it's 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 madhouse. Everybody, all the departments got to bleed into one another. Actors carrying, you know, <laughs> lights, props. You know, the grips, acting, you know, everything. It was, it was, it was fun. It's kind of like guerrilla movie making. You we just had to make sure that we could get all of our locations, you know, on the Upper West Side, as, as close to the Upper West Side as possible, so we weren't moving all over the place all the time. I mean, it was a whirlwind. You were, right. I mean, you didn't really stop to think about it. You just knew that you had this right. incredible deadline, right. and we just were all worked right. what, 12, 14 hour days. Yeah, it was crazy days, and we would show up, and you know, there's lots. Of, I mean, it's a complicated movie, too, and there's a lot of setups, and there's a lot of um, like eyeline changes and things like that, which usually you take a little bit more time. But um, I think, especially with the big scenes, just shooting and shooting and shooting, it's a total whirlwind. I mean, I, I remember, I barely remember like having a lunch, and I think at lunch I would like take a spoonful of peanut butter and lay down on the floor down wherever we were shooting minutes, for 30 yeah. minutes and then get back up and be like, okay, let's make more movie. It's one of those crazy things in New York City, a bus co is coming, I'm running for the bus, I just make a mad dash because I say I'm not going to miss this bus, slipped on something, went up, landed on my back really, really badly. And I think two days later I had to shoot that scene, Jack and I had to shoot the scene where I'm throwing fish at him. And I was in... In blind agony. You know, Physically. you make a film and it's so long ago by the time you finally see it that you've done so many things in between you don't even remember. Um, I, I guess my favorite part of making the film was working with the other actors. It was great people I was working with, John and Jack, and I just really enjoyed their company. I think the festival's been amazing. Um, the crowds have been great. Last night we had a you know, overflow crowd at Woodstock, at the Playhouse, which I think is the biggest venue. Um, and the theater was erupting with Laugh. I mean, it was people were laughing at the right spots. They were crying at the right spots. Um, I think they got the funny and the emotional impact of the movie. And I think today was really great. I think it was a great, you know, I mean, having done a lot of theater, you know, like the matinee audience is always going to be. But this was a great audience. And they were right there with the movie the whole time and laughing and invested. And um, I think, you know, Rick wrote a really great script. And I think you it's a movie where you care about the characters and you invest in them in a way that not a lot of movies nowadays allow you to do that. And I think people were, when I knew when it was deadly quiet at the end of this, the fight between the uncle and Walter, I knew that we were in a good place.
Yeah. You know, when it, when the audience is really quiet, that's a better sign for me, in terms of how the movie's being received. So, and I thought it was great, and the festival's great, the audience is great, really love it. All right. Okay. Yeah. All right. So hey guys, everybody, vote, vote five, please for us. Please. Please.